The following tag team contest is scheduled for one fall on the way to the ring. At a combined weight of 590 pounds, Eric Rowan and Luke Harper, the Wyatt family. It seems like this guy, Eric Rowan, has a real passion for delivering pain. Ooh, this could get... And their opponents first, from Bray County, Wicklow, Ireland, weighing in at 252 pounds, the Mixed Martial Arts World Heavyweight Fighting Champion, the Legend. From Grand Rapids, Michigan, weighing in at 151 pounds, Max Weaver. Oh, the referee will undoubtedly have his hands full when these two teams collide. Man, these teams have been waiting for this. Thank you for joining us tonight, folks. We have an amazing night ahead of us. Yeah, and we're just moments away from tonight's opening match. I can't wait. This one should be great, and it's just gonna keep getting better as the night goes on. Now, why did he do that? A move like that's low. It's appalling, if you ask me. Totally disrespectful. Well, when he sees a belt, he likes to hit below it. What does Eric Rowan need to do to win tonight? It's a tag team match, so the parts are sometimes greater than the whole. What can we expect here? Between his strength, amazing intellect, and absolute disregard for his own well-being, you'd have to think Eric Rowan is the perfect tag team partner. I have to say, I think that this team's ready to go right to the top of WWE's tag team division. That stop might have only lasted a second, but it's going to be felt tomorrow. That may be felt for a lifetime. I don't know if we have enough time in this broadcast to cover all the ways Eric Rowan is dangerous. For starters, Rowan has immeasurable strength and speed. You won't believe how Rowan moves for a man who stands six foot eight and weighs 315 pounds. Oh, and let's not forget. He's completely deranged. Well, I think you covered all the major ones, Cole. When you think about the size and speed Eric Rowan possesses, it's more than enough to get your attention. Then, add to that the... Oh, there's the finishing move. Don't know if you have anything left after that. Oh, look at this. Can we face facts, please? They don't have just one opponent to worry about. They have two. Jerry, when we talk about Eric Rowan's speed, power, and yes, his twisted mind, the one thing we also need to mention is his toughness. It takes a ton of offense for an opposing superstar to bring Eric Rowan down, let alone keep him down. Huge headlock, and now what? He's in full-on attack mode now. What? He's still not through? I don't think so. Oh, look at the emotion. He's too busy bragging and boasting than battling in this matchup. You know, Michael, when I think of Eric Rowan, which I'd rather not, it's almost impossible for me to choose which of his weapons is the most dangerous. I will tell you this, when you combine that speed, power, toughness, and mental state, you get one scary individual. This match has taken so much out of this guy, he's not gonna give up. But man, this has been physical. And Luke Harper gets out of that one. Nice move. Oh no, hard shot now. 
Nasty landing. He makes the tag. Great reversal. Watch it. Hey, Cole, this could do it. I think so. I don't know how much longer he's going to be able to go. Eric Rowan is one of the rare individuals that I've seen in this business that as soon as people see him, they immediately think of terrible things happening. Then the trick is just making sure you're not on his list. He wants no part of the outside. And I don't blame him. Nothing good ever happens outside the ring. He almost took his head off with that lariat. He's delivering an old-fashioned butt kicking right here. And I think he's begging him to bring it. Oh, gosh, look at that cut. Think what must be going through the mind of Eric Rowan's opponent. It doesn't take someone too long looking at him to tell that Eric Rowan does not have good intentions, and the fans carefully watch each step he takes. That's control of an audience. We got one-on-one -on -one action coming your way next. Going to be good. We have a real fan favorite against an imposing adversary. <laughs> oh, man. I can't wait to see these two go at it. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Make it
making his way to the ring from parts unknown, weighing in at 274 pounds, the hero. Oh well, boy, we're in for a treat tonight. Both of these superstars look geared up and ready to go. Oh, the look on this guy's face tells me he's about to inflict some major pain. Ooh, you better look out. And his opponent, from Brooklyn, New York, weighing in at 260 pounds, The Punisher. Oh, I can't wait to see this one. Oh, this one's going to be a hard-hitting affair, just the way I like them. Hello, ladies and gentlemen, and thank you for joining us tonight. I'm Michael Cole alongside Jerry the King Lawler here at Ringside and King. Tonight should be extremely exciting. Well, you said it, Cole. It looks like we don't have to wait long for the action to start either. Let's go. We're starting things off strong tonight. I don't remember the last time he executed that maneuver. Unleashing it for the second time now. Oh, no! Talk about getting launched out of the ring! This is a level of destruction no one was expecting. I certainly didn't expect to see this kind of damage. Whoa. He's taking some offense. This could be the start of an ugly downward spiral if he's not careful. And it looked to me like neither of these guys are showing signs of pulling away here. Well said, John. And now's the time for one of these guys to take hold of this match. He leaps into the air for a flying forearm. offense here. Yeah, that's when he's the most dangerous. A textbook reversal. Can he follow up? Uh-oh, look at this. Oh, Try to put him away. Well, I've never seen him do that before. Catches him off guard with that amazing acrobatic move. Look out below! Look out! This guy's just getting worn out. We may have discovered his favorite move. You think? He seems to use it often enough. Showing a great deal of faith and trust in that move. Talk about having the living hell beat out of you. Looks to me like he just hit a wall. Well, he has certainly taken a turn for the worst. For the pin and the win! Two, three, three. It's all over. 
That's the final elimination. Here's your winner, The Punisher. We got one-on-one -on -one action coming your way next, King. It's the best. It will be Apollo Crews in a match that is sure to not disappoint. <laughs> oh, man. I can't wait to see these two go at it. The following contest is scheduled for one fall, making his way to the ring from Stone Mountain, Georgia, weighing in at 240 pounds, Apollo Crews. As we get ready for singles action, I like to remind everyone that you can follow us at hashtag WWE2K, now trending worldwide. I think I'll tweet about us right now. Big opportunity to prove yourself here on SmackDown. And his opponent, from Chicago, Illinois, weighing in at 218 pounds, C.M. Punk. Here we go. The singles match will not disappoint. I can guarantee you that. You're right about that. Let's get it going. What a night we have in store for you. Thank you for joining us. I'm Michael Cole alongside Jerry the King Lawler on what should be an amazing night of action. Yeah, and I don't know which match I'm looking forward to the most, Michael, but what I do know is that we're just moments away from kicking this thing off. The WWE Universe is gonna love this one. Getting back into the ring now. He hits the drop kick from an incredible vertical leap. Let's take a moment to discuss Apollo Crews. Not only does he have a great deal of respect for himself, but it should also be mentioned how much he respects this business as a whole. Definitely looking confident in this one-on-one -on -one environment. That's a good sign. Well, good for him, Michael. There's plenty about the sports entertainment industry that should be respected, including me, the king. A knockdown, drag out brawl, complete with a big stomp. And these guys are throwing bombs. They're pulling out all the stops. I don't know if we've seen that from him before. I mean, it's definitely a first tonight. This is great. This guy will try anything. Camel clutch. He needs to figure out a way to get to his base and break the hole. Hey! And he fights out of it. He breaks the hole. Cruz seems to have lost a step now. But he's very aware of who he's in there with and what he has to do to rebound. I tell you, we knew this was going to be a close affair, but I don't think we expected it to be this time. What a match. Oh, it's been a great match up to this point, and this could really go either way. The fist drop will leave you gasping for air, that's for sure. Hard to breathe after that. He's going for it all. This could be it. That stop might have only lasted a second, but it's going to be felt tomorrow. That may be felt for a lifetime. Nice reversal. Those feet are clearly a bright spot in this offense. Yeah, those feet are working overtime tonight. And there's the reversal. And another one. I like this. 
It's called repetitive, Cole. It works. He's pulling out all the stops tonight. He was able to reverse that. A textbook reversal. Can he follow up? Taking this type of punishment must be damaging to his sternum. Damaging to his entire chest. He almost took his head off with that lariat. He's setting it up. Look at this! He's in a world of trouble. Much more of this, and I doubt he'll be able to... He's going for the pin. This could be it. I think he's got him. I don't believe it. The match is over. Here's your winner, C.M. Hold on to your seats. We have singles action coming up next. I'm looking forward to it. We have Kevin Owens against Seth Rollins. I've been waiting for this matchup. Come on, ring the bell. The following contest is scheduled for one fall, making his way to the ring. From Maryville, Quebec, Canada, weighing in at 266 pounds, Kevin Owens. The man has made his way up from NXT to become the upper echelon of the WWE locker room. Kevin Owens, look. Thank you for choosing to spend your evening with us. I'm Michael Cole alongside, as always, Jerry the King Law. And I can't think of another place I'd rather be, Michael. Right out of the gate, we've got a huge match. Heck, every match tonight is huge. The guy's got no regard for the rules. Now back to the ring, Kevin Owens. What could be going through his mind right now? This guy couldn't care less what the fans think of him, which is good for him considering how much they despise him. It's going to take a lot to beat him tonight, Michael. From what I've been told, he's been spending extra hours in the gym in anticipation of getting in the ring with this guy. Who cares what anyone thinks of you? I mean, if they are not signing your checks, then they shouldn't matter. This 
playing a wide range of offense here. I don't remember the last time he executed that maneuver. It's locked. This is a dreaded submission move. The tendons must be ready to snap. A submission victory has to be imminent. Yeah, you're right about that. The tap out has to be coming soon. You have to respect that Kevin Owens knows what he wants and goes right after it. He's one of the most no-nonsense competitors we've seen in a long time. Yeah, but I got the leg. Oh, what a painful submission. Watch it! And he powers out. And that one hurt his hand. Well, that messed him all right. Hey, did you look before firing? What an idiot. He's sending a message to the entire WWE locker room here. Take a look at that again. It, will it be? One, two, three. And you can put this singles match in the books. Here's your winner, representing the Shield. Uh-oh, this is the confrontation we've all been waiting for. Whoa, I didn't see that coming. Yeah, that's because Seth Rollins... Ha-ha, <laughs> get in there and handle business. Reminds me of myself in my younger days. Interesting move here, taking the match to the outside. Interesting and dangerous. God, there was nothing accurate about that attempt at offense. Oh, you're being too kind. Some people would use other words to describe what we just witnessed. Somehow, he's kicked it into another gear here tonight. Few superstars are as dominant as this guy. Seth Rollins in some trouble here. This could be the start of an ugly downward spiral if he's not careful. And it looks to me like neither of these guys are showing signs of pulling away here. It's a good point, John. And I'd say this match is about as even as it can get at this point.